Okay guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a little quick video uh, and this is how to up-res uh, your drone footage. Now this can actually be any footage um, but yeah, it does look good if you do up-res it and it's really quick and simple. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show you how to do that. So, first, what you're going to want to do yeah. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is go to Safari. Okay, and you're going to download this tool now it's called handbrake and basically all it does is it encodes the video which it somehow makes the file smaller even if you want it in 4k i really don't know how it's a really clever app and i really do like it uh it does look kind of like a bit of a dodgy website really but i've been using it for a while and i haven't really noticed anything wrong with it um so yeah what you're going to need is this so you're going to press download for mac uh, there is other platforms underneath so I think if you try and download this for Windows, it will uh, it will say download for Windows. It recognises what platform you're on. But yeah, download it for your um, platform. And then yeah, once you've downloaded it, press it to open. I haven't actually added it to my applications yet. Um, I don't really know why, I just haven't. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to press on it. Normally I wouldn't have to do this, but... Uh, yeah, if you're downloading it from the internet on a Mac, then yeah, you're gonna want to do this. Um, so yeah, once it loads up, okay, cool. So once it's open up, you can close anything that's just gonna happen. And yeah, basically, all you're gonna do is open the source. So say if I just want to upload the most recent video, which is drone crashes. Now, as you can see, it's the same file by the way. I had a problem with iMovie. Um, but yeah, as you see, drone crashes is 1.9 gigabytes at the moment, uh, and yeah, it's in 1080, I think. If I load up iMovie, uh, so yeah, as you can see, uh, it says 1080, so it's currently in 1080. So once we load it up, all we have to do is press preset, and then I'd, I think it's web. And yeah, basically, if you want to upload it to, it doesn't really matter, but yeah, Vimeo, YouTube will do if you're going to do it to that. And yeah, all you got to do is press 4K um, and then press start. And basically, all it's going to do is duplicate the video. So you can have two copies, but you can delete them once, you know, they've been uploaded to YouTube. And basically, yeah, all we're going to do is encode it. And yeah, it's then going to change to 4K. Yeah, the file is 4K, so if you upload it to YouTube, it will say 4K. Um, and yeah, that's it really. So yeah, once this loads up, all you're going to do is I'm going to actually p paste it into iMovie. And as you can see, it says 4K. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.